What is up guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Omar and today's and also's video is going to be about the new signing of Arsenal, Thomas Partey. So Arsenal have officially completed the signing of Thomas Partey from Athletic Madrid after they agreed to pay his release clause of £45 million. Even though Thomas Partey is a defensive midfielder, but unlike most of the other defensive midfielders, Thomas Partey is not a static player and he is given the freedom to move around to help his team in both phases of the game. If we try to look at the heat map of Thomas Partey, we can see that he covers a lot of ground from flank to flank and from one goal box to the other goal box. But despite this freedom to move around, Thomas Partey is still a defensive midfielder who operates more like a central midfielder and Thomas Partey does the job of protecting his defense very effectively. The most important job of a defensive midfielder is to protect the defense and provide defensive cover to his fullbacks, especially on transitions. The defensive midfielder should ideally sit in front of the two center backs and he should be able to help his fullbacks and the center backs on transitions. When the fullbacks move up to help in the offensive phase, they often leave the wide spaces open, which could be very harmful if the opponents are able to catch you on counter attacks. And this is where the defensive midfielder comes into play. The defensive midfielder should be able to cover those wide areas to stop or delay the attack so that the teammates can get back into their defensive positions. The opponent checks his shoulder and he can see Trippier coming to press it. So he immediately plays a long pass in the open wide space that was left open by Trippier. Pass in the open wide space to catch Atletico Madrid on transition, but Thomas Partey steps out to cover the wide space and to provide defensive cover to Trippier. Delaying the attack and now Atletico Madrid have the numbers back in position. Trippier is once again caught out of his position, but Thomas Partey's defensive positioning once again helps him to provide defensive cover to Trippier. The fullback steps out to cover the wide winger. Thomas Partey checks his shoulder and he can see the opponent making the run in the open half space. So Thomas Partey immediately drops in the defense to provide cover to his fullback. One of the key strengths of Thomas Partey is the ability to retain possession when under pressure and to move the ball forward. Thomas Partey had the best dribble success rate last season in Europe's top 5 leagues with a success rate of 88.3% which clearly indicates his ability to drive forward with the ball and not being afraid of taking on players. Shoulder check to see the position of the opponent and Thomas Partey can see the opponent coming to press him from behind. So Thomas Partey lets the ball run in the open space and he makes a no touch turn to easily take out the opponent.
Even though Thomas Partey is known for his defensive duties, but he is really good when it comes to making the play and playing forward passes. Out of all the Atletico midfielders, Thomas Partey used to play the most forward passes 19.41, most final third passes 10.91 and most progressive passes 10.46 per 90 minutes. Thomas Partey on average makes 8.12 recoveries per game, which ranks him amongst one of the very best in the world. Thomas Partey will definitely make a huge impact and 50 million euros for a player of his quality is nothing in today's market. Thank you so much guys for watching the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please don't forget to like and subscribe.